everybody! Here are the macarons that we made in the last video. Um, I haven't actually posted it yet, so I th this might actually come up before um, yes. before the, the video comes out on how to make the macarons with the cup quick batter. Um, super, super fun, super sparkly, and super cute. So we're going to do a demo on how these work. And I have some leftovers here, so we'll see what happens. And that one sunk because it's got a heavy, heavy. See how, see how the dyes disperse? Even with that little whip, the entire bowl, and this is my big punch bowl, is gorgeous. Here, let's see if we can show you the show. Let's see what's going on with that. Oh, look at that. This stuff, this is the bubble. Um, icing from uh, Miriam um, Sachel, Sachel, I'm probably pronouncing it wrong. Um, and this is the Teal Easy Colors. So this is going to be a moisturizing, wonderful bath. It's got a lot of cocoa butter in there. Um, it's going to be fantastic. So there you go. So this will slowly dissolve. It's heavier. Um, so if you don't want your bombs to sink, then you're going to have to use less of it. You just use a smaller quantity than I did. You want them to see the whole show. I also did use an embed in these bigger ones here. So those will be interesting to see. I should probably put in you know, a contrasting color like purple. That would go really well with this. Or a darker green, but that gives you an idea. Up. One of the things you can do with the bubble batter recipe for cupquakes that is now posted online. I'll also post a link to the recipe for this one um, as well. The um, Suds and Sets shared it here on Facebook. So go say hi to her and say hello and thank you. And uh, look at how easily that breaks up. This was really fun stuff to play with. Let's see how it foams. That was really, really fun stuff. And so I took my leftovers because I didn't have that many. And I'm going to make some needle moisturizing macarons, I think, with them. I might even make a batch of it just for that. Um, if it gets hard like this and you want it to soften up again so you can pipe it, just warm it up in your microwave. Super pretty. Super fun. Join us next time if you enjoyed this and you want to learn how to make new and, and innovative things for your bath. Please subscribe to my channel and hit like, and I'm always, always excited to hear from my subscribers. So come on in and say hello. Bye for now.